kind of feel like that's how everybody is um, around this time. You know, they put away anything like that on the shelf, and it's all about Fashion Week, you know, and it's what we love, and that's what I love, and yeah, I'm really excited to be a part of it. It was three months ago. Um, I got a phone call from Matt asking me to dress him and his wife, Kara, for every single event during Awesome Fashion Week. And of course, I was like, uh, yes. Um, super stoked, literally almost peed in my pants. It wasn't necessarily something that I set out to do. Um, I owned Rare Magazine here in Austin, started it in 2004. And uh, when the magazine business was no fun anymore, starting around 2008, we had started some big, large-scale events in town. And I, I love the event side. And um, there was clearly a need for a bigger fashion event around Austin. You know, as the food scene grew and film and music, it was funny that Fashion always sort of lagged behind. It, it clearly has a place here. And um, I think it needed uh, somebody with more of a business mind and less of a fashion mind to kind of create something. And that's, that, that's really why I started. I had a lot of friends in the business on the fashion side and the creative side. And, you know, we thought we could come in and start something and run it as an actual business. and you know, make it work for them too. I feel blessed because I've met um, some amazing designers, working with Ross Bennett and Micah Yancey and Musa Otto, he's the brand manager for League of Rebels. It's a men's suit line, epic. If you are a, a man, you should own a suit from League of Rebels. Um, and then Sarah McLaughlin with her line, Sarah Eileen. She's designed a, a lovely dress for Kara. Um, and I feel like they're my family now. So, you know, there's several elements that go into styling, you know, a person, a couple. Um, it's not just Oh, here's a pretty shirt and, you know, skirt, put that on and you're going to look great. You know, to really show that this person who's made all of this possible for us Not that you don't, but Sandy amazing. <laughs> I think Matt's doing a great job now um, with, Fashion, with Fashion Week. It's gotten a lot bigger and better. The sponsors he's getting are huge. Fiat, Circuit of Americas. He's got Kaplan Miller now doing all of their production, which is like pretty high-end stuff. They do some of the biggest and best parties in the city. Um, and just from a production level, I opened Fashion Week with Circuit of Americas and shift into style, and that was the most professional production I've ever seen here in Austin. So. I'm very happy to be a part of it again this year and not only get to show one collection, but two.
I love about the fashion industry is there's such a passion uh, from everybody involved, you know, down to the interns and the photographers and the stylists and, you know, and the volunteers and the culmination of all that hard work and desire and passion, you know, is, is really shown and highlighted during Austin Fashion Week. Um, you know, take for example Stephen Mosier. I mean, he's an amazing journalist, he's a fashion icon, and he's been sick, you know, for a while. Um, and here he is showing his line this year. Just to know him, you know, he's amazing. The day that my first article appeared, I got a fax from a reader. Faxes, they're so quick. And I've started designing clothing again, which has been my new religion. And so all of a sudden, after not designing for a number of years, I have found something that means a great deal to me. And Fashion Week is always a fun part of that. You know, it's such a huge, fashion inspires everything, from architecture to cars, to the way we eat and the way we drink and everything like that. And so he realized that he needed to bring in people from other, all over the country. So people started filtering in from New York, Los Angeles over the last couple of years. And now we're going, now he's gone global, which is really awesome. So he's doing a great job, Matt, keep it up. Uh, you know, I'm happy to be a part. Yeah, I think it's great. You know, I, Austin is not considered a fashion capital, but I would challenge anybody that we can pick up that Just runway and those designers and put them in New York tomorrow, and no one would know the difference. For gold. Sure to crumble without a sound